Well, it didn't take long for the team at Sabanto to make their mark in the ag tech industry. They started building their first autonomy kit from scratch in the three-car garage of an employee back in September 2019. Just three months after that, they were out in the field autonomously planting. Now they're working hard to bring the Sabanto autonomy system to the marketplace. VP of product, Corey Spietti, gives us a sneak peek at the technology and how it works. All right, Noah. So, so some of the componentry that we add to the vehicles would be things like a steering valve, electro-hydraulic remote valves, uh, obstacle detection cameras. Up on top of the vehicle, we have we have our GPS receiver and our, our our surveillance cameras, and then the two the two white colored ones are our uh, our LTE antennas. But at the heart of it all is our is our main main control box. And so this this control box, forgive the appearance here, we're in the the middle of testing our, our first uh, prototypes. This is this is the the brain box of the whole system. It it tells the, tr the it receives the mission plans from you know, from our cloud infrastructure. And basically it spits out all the commands to the steering valve, to the brake actuators, to the, to the rear remote valves, to the hitches and all of those, all those accoutrements on the, on the tractor. Um, I do want to say, I want to mention one thing that all, you know, all of our systems allow the tractor to be fully humanly operatable uh, if it's on there. So with the flick of the flick of a four switches, we can go from, from, manual mode to to autonomy mode or in this case from autonomy mode to to manual mode and so it makes it easy to do things like load the vehicle onto a trailer or pull it into a field or maybe pull it inside of a barn you know all the things that that farmers do do today good stuff there from Corey. we'll have much more from him and sabanto in our day in the cab feature next month on precisionfarmingdealer.com in the technology corner i'm noah newman